Hi, in this package tracer activity, we will exploring files and data encryption. The objective is, of this activity is on part one, we will locate the FTP account credentials for Mary's laptop. On part two, we will upload confidential data using FTP. On part three, we will locate the FTP account credentials for both PC. On part four, we will download confidential data using FTP. And uh, on the last part, we will decrypt the contents of the uh, client info.tt file. The scenario uh, we will access encrypted contents of multiple files and transfer a file across the internet to a centralized FTP server. Another user will then download the file from the FTP server and decrypt the file's contents. Now we move on to part 1. Locate the FTP account credentials for Mary's laptop. On step 1, we access the text documents on Mary's laptop. Click on the healthcare at home and click on Mary. Then we click on desktop and click to text editor. On the file menu, we open the client info. Uh, oh no the FTP login .txt. It is uh, the file that contain the FTP account in encrypted form for Mary. And here is a uh, encrypted uh, uh, FTP account for Mary. Now we have to decrypt it by copy this file and download uh, decryption software at uh, encypher.it Now I can uh, another one we can click on answer encypher.it I copy it and on the encypher.it I paste Sorry, I copy all the text from the file and paste it into the encipher.it and then click on decipher. Now we should enter the description password. The password. Mary FTP one two three. I copy it and paste it here, and then I click on decrypt. And here, the Mary FTP account information with the username and the password. Please note that this information is the FTP account, and it had just. Uh, decrypt and Mary know it. Now we move on to part two. Upload confidential data using FTP. On step one, we will view the confidential document on Mary's laptop. Uh, we will open the client info.txt. I click on file and open the client form. This file is very important because it contains the information uh, client of uh, Mary. And the form, uh, the, uh, the data is encrypted so no one can decrypt it without a key. Because this software use uh, AES encryption uh, 
for the text. Next, we will remotely connect to the FTP server to upload this file to the server. Close and open command prompt and type FTP, FTP and enter the IP address. And the username we can get here Mary with the password Cisco 321 Mary Cisco 321 Now I have just logged in to the FTP server and on step 3, I will upload a file to the FTP server by using the command Firstly, we will enter dear command and view all the files that have already existed on this server Now I will put Client info dot uh, The transfer has completed, and I show. And here, user file have just uploaded to uh, the server. And there's a question on step three: if cyber criminals were to capture the file transfer crossing the internet what would be in clear text so as you know the FTP protocol uh, does not uh, encrypt the username and password when transferring uh, data uh, to from the uh, client to the server so the uh, account, FTP account information should be in clear text. But the client info.txt remains in encryption form. Now we move on to part 3, locate the FTP account credential for both PC. We do the same on the Bob PC on the bank. I click on Bob Squares Bob PC here and then I open the text editor and open the FTP login txt file and open it and here we should uh, decrypt uh, to take the Bob FTP account I copy and then I paste it into encipher.it Cipher it with the password Bob FTP one two three. I copy it. Oh, sorry. Encrypt. It's decrypt. Decrypt. Decrypt, we need to download the software. So I do it again. I fit a uh, box uh, uh, encryption data to the, this uh, form and decipher it with the password of FTP123. 
Bon. Et puis, on va le Écrit. And here, the box uh, confirmation. Username and uh, password. And next, we will uh, download the confidential data using the FTP on Bob PC. Uh, Click on here's a Mary with the Bob. I close and on command prompt, I FTP to the server. Sorry, it's not the IP address of the FTP server for Bob. The FTP for Bob is 10. Dot for one. With username, we can take it from here yeah, the Bob and Ninja123. Just log it in, and then we will type dear, and Bob will see the client info dot txt, and Bob will download it using the command get client info dot txt. We have just download the that file to Bob PC. Now I exit it and I'll quit the FTP. Now I click on text editor to open the client info dot on Bob PC. Open it and here. It's the content of the file in encrypted form. So to uh, decrypt it, we need a, a decryption key from Mary. And Mary had just sent an email contain the decryption key for Bob. And so we check the email on Bob PC and here Mary with the description key, I open it and the key to decrypt any sensitive file is Cisco 1 through 3 so I copy the information or the data on uh, the encrypted data and then I paste it into the encipher.it and uh, I click on decrypt the file get some file I refresh it again and I paint it and we got decrypt oh. cannot decrypt Maybe I uh, close uh, this window and reopen it. Uh, I, uh, after close the window and reopen it, I copy the content and the decipher it with the password that will be sent on uh, Mary. One, two, three. And I decrypt. Invalid password. I check again on more PC. Email. A Cisco one, two, three. Not Mary. As 
you know if we don't have the correct password we cannot decrypt uh, the, the file and here the client information on the, uh, the file now on part 5 we decrypt uh, we have just uh, complete the part 5 decrypt the content of the clan info.txt and there's a question on this part what is the first account name in the client info.txt file so the first account name is Plato X Rich so that is all for the activity and thanks for watching